So I'll, I'll talk about a battle, and I'm gonna I'm gonna, I want to dip back to Max Out Three, but I want to talk about a battle that a lot of people have been talking about. Where, and I want to know your opinion on it. It's release, and then it's eventually hitting a mur million views. Murder Move vs Big K, right? Okay. okay. I have heard, you know what I'm saying. I didn't speak to you about this, but I'm asking you about this now. Uh, that you were not satisfied with the level of promotion by Murder Move on that battle. Is that true or false? That's true. That's true. That's true. Um, the expectation for the A side, especially for a main event, mm -hmm. right? And and that's not to detract anything from one of the goats, Big K, right? Right. But Murder Mook is a is a higher profile, or you know, in battle rap than Big K, yeah. Right. Um, there's a couple of those guys, you know, they're going to be looked at like that. The Murder Moves, the Hitmans, the Cassidy's, the Loaded Luxes. Yeah, top guys, yeah. Yeah, yeah, that's just how it goes, right? And, um, you know, for those guys, you know, everybody knows they cost the most. Yeah. Right? So there's the business element of it. There's the, um, there's also the element of, like, this ain't our first rodeo. Like, yeah. you know, we didn't been here watching one hand watch the other multiple times getting big bags together. You know what I'm saying? Showing each other new things that they haven't done before, business wise and battle rap and all that type of stuff. Right. So there, there's a couple of elements there that just, if you're in my shoes, you're gonna have a little bit of a letdown. But you know, you, you go like this and you move on and then you follow up and max out three. Do you think it's because right. people feel like you lost? Say again? Do you think you didn't promote it because people feel like you lost? Oh no, no. So first of all, I'm not, I'm not worried about the promotion after the battle. Mm -hmm. Oh, so you talking about the promotion before the battle? Yeah, I thought that's what you was talking about. I'm talking about after the battle. So after the battle. So, 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 so I'll, I'll say this: I don't, I don't, I don't hover over any battle rap before promotion after. Oh. Now you might, you might have some stipulations or some clauses or some requests. You know, it's just like yo, do do one interview after your battle or whatever. And the people that win their battles, they usually do. The you have no problem doing. I haven't seen people win battles and go on a whole tour. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, he went on a tour. He was hosting clubs and shit. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. <laughs> they got to walk through their strip club. This, 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 this is what I'm trying to say. So for for certain battles, um, you know, you don't have to ask That's the battle to promote them. Because they're gonna do it. You know, like if you don't release Hitman versus Conceited in so much in so so much time. That man gonna put on his flag. Like, <laughs> they gonna keep I'm gonna this battle rap history for y'all. Right, 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 right. But, but, so that's, nah, I don't hover over people for their post battle. And then on top of that, I do understand that there's a human element. Like, let's say somebody, I'm not talking about, I'm not talking about move. Mm -hmm. Let's say somebody choked in their battle. Mm -hmm. Let's say somebody lost bad in their battle. They got 30 in their battle. Right. You, you think I'm, I'm gonna expect them to turn around and promote it? Heavy, Absolutely whatever. not. <laughs> Some people fucking try to get their battles vaulted that lose. They've been trying to get battles vaulted? Like, that. you just sat down with somebody that was complaining about their battles. Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, <I'm> living, <laughs> this is your content. No, I, like, I, you I, just brought yes, this up. Yes, yes, yes. It's your yes, content. Right, right, yes, right. I'm talking about an RBE, but you're right. Yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. using your shit to make the point for your own question about. about after right or oh, after like people won't i got yeah you. so certain people want their battles out some people don't certain there's all types of factors there so now i'm not i don't hover over the before what's the so you know what I'm so you don't hover over there i mean I, over the after. the after over the after yeah. now before no, not really not what really. What is the, I mean, you don't have to be specific about it. There are certain things that they should be required to do, like post a flyer and all that type of stuff, right? Yeah, yeah. So so I'll say it like this, and it doesn't necessarily pertain Not to this exactly battle. Exactly to, to that battle. Yeah. Um, one thing that you should definitely do is the things that's in your contract. Mm. Like, if you don't at least do the things that's in your contract, then I definitely got to look at you a different way. Mm. Because... When all else fails, if, if it's like, I don't give a fuck about us as friends, I don't give a fuck about us as future business, I don't give a fuck about um, nothing, if, if, which, which is totally fine because those situations is business. Mm -hmm. Where it's just like, yo, I'm here for my money, I'm, I'm gonna do my job and that's it. If that's what it is, mm -hmm. then you should at least do your job. Right, just right? if you're gonna do the bare minimum, do the bare minimum. And it, it doesn't even have to use the word minimum. Right, just it could just be requirement. What, what, what's, 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 what's in the agreement? Yeah. yeah. So if you don't do that, that that's 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 one thing. Mm -hmm. Then on top of that, you have an aspect of being a hustler. Like I always like a trip, like somebody like Arsenal, right? Mm -hmm. In private, in public, I always give Arsenal credit as being 
arguably the top hustler mm. that I've ever worked with and I know, know from battle rap. Mm. When I say hustler, I mean somebody that's gonna make sure he gets to it, mm. somebody that's gonna make sure that he negotiates, mm. somebody that's gonna make sure he follows up, mm. somebody that's gonna make sure that he deals in a way where that relationship carries forward as long as possible. Mm. Those are keys to success and sometimes it's who you know. Mm. Like there's certain people in battle rap, they call me right now and say, yo, let me get a bag with you real quick and it's done because of what we, what we built and what, what you showed and our relationship, the trust, all that. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So even if it's not part of the contract, mm. you also got to have the hustle mentality. The like if I didn't made a million dollars with this person before, I might be able to make a million dollars on tomorrow or next week or after that. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, so even if I don't fuck with him, even if I don't fuck with the platform, even if I don't fuck with the matchup, even if whatever. I'm like still find a way to get to because that. I'm a hustler, right? So like, why burn a bridge with a, a nigga that I know could go into his pocket mm -hmm. and give me some, not just some couple dollars, like really could give me some money, money. And, you know what I'm saying? And, like, like, I don't get it. It's not hustle. That's not hustling to me. And you're smart because, and, and I don't want to like really lament on this too much, but uh, I know there's been times where you've mended a lot of relationships. Yeah, right? we've been talking for three days. If we said yeah. how many times. You came and been an intermediate individual, and I can just say it on camera, you know, Big K, you know, I ain't tough. If I saw him in traffic, we pass each other, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And as far as his career, you can't have somebody that's in a position to cover you that's not going to cover you because of whatever riff we had, you know what I'm saying? I don't even know what the issue I don't. I still to this day don't even know what it was. But you were influential when you were brought, when I called you originally to come to television, wanted to bring him. And I originally was like, oh, no. <laughs> I was like, yo, we gotta figure this out first. Yeah, so but you've other. done, and we're good, that's my man now, you yeah, know what yeah. I'm saying? It'd be funny that you've done that, but what do you see as the vying tool to do that? Because I know you've done it a lot of times before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, you gotta have your own credibility and respect. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, I get, I, I've been called as a neutral party for a lot of situations. And, and I, I pride myself on that because once again, if some of the biggest managers or battle rappers or whatever in battle rap can call me and say, hey, can you do me a favor? Can you get this other person on the phone? Or yo, I wanna, wanna ask you some advice for something or whatever that's going on. And then I'll fuck around, take that and reach out to Vada. And next thing you know, these two guys are together. Or I'll fuck around and did, like I, I was dealing with some shit yesterday. I'll tell you off camera. Yeah, so I mean, like I said, I, I literally would, you know, some of that just yesterday, mm -hmm. like no bullshit. And, um, you know, I kind of, I, 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 I'm honored mm -hmm. that, you know what I'm saying, like sometimes you could help help somebody and then right. sometimes that energy and that calm come back your way too. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So it's, 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 just, it's just part of it. Right, um, so I, I, I didn't have my fallout. So <laughs> you, you had you know so many of them, but we let that ride. Right. You know, I, I definitely tried. I, I fixed a lot of my own issues with people mm -hmm. that I've had with people. And I've also been a neutral party to try to help a lot of shit going on. So, you know, I'm, this is karma right. that you try to build. That's all. So, I'm going to spin back to Max Out 3. Uh, what was the decision to put it in a small room? A lot of, I know a lot of people, myself included. We're like, yo, you're bugging, yo, you're bugging. Why you ain't at the Grand Music Hall? Why you ain't at, why you ain't at Webster Hall? Why you ain't, because we he see this card and I think, at, how many how many times did you get that phone call, text, or message? It had to be easily 50, 100 times. You probably just guessed it. You know what I mean? <laughs> yeah. And that's, that's, that's the people that got my content. Right. The tweets and oh my ran, God. somebody ran to be able to like, like Logs yeah. and random <laughs> shit like that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, nah, it's, it's a ton, but um, been here, done that. Mm -hmm. So, once again, my memory worked just fine. Like, the first time we got that wave of criticism was in 2018, not 2023. Mm. Right, it was in 2018 when we announced A Bird versus Murder Move, and we said we were going to be hosting in Club Drum. Ah, Drum, yeah. And they killed us. Mm -hmm. They said, how dare, like, Murder Move's been gone for almost five years. How dare Bring you? Bring it to more room. Yeah. And we, I, I swear on everything, we said, if it's not broke, don't fix it. Even though the scale of this matchup is monumental, mm -hmm. like why why break the formula mm -hmm. of what we're doing mm -hmm. and how much we've added back into the battle rap culture of what this type of environment produces? Right. 
why break that now that we have to that point the biggest matchup that we ever booked? 